Yeah, I just wanted to show you a quick way to change the default automatic quick save location inside of ZBrush. So the first thing you need to do is go find your quick save folder. Uh, I'm running Windows 7, 64. So it's under computer, local disk, uh, users, public, public documents, ZBrush data, quick save. So you're going to take this folder, you're going to cut it, and you're going to paste it over to the target location. Uh, in my case, I just picked a drive. Um, for this example, I'm picking the D drive. So you cut it from your C drive, you paste it to your new location. So after that, you should have no quick save folder here. This quick save show folder should be pasted into your new location. Now after that, you're going to go over to your taskbar or whatever it's called and you're going to run the uh, command prompt but run it as a administrator cmd right click run as administrator and then you're going to type this this uh, line of code or whatever it's called it's mklink forward slash j then you're going to put in the location of the uh, quick save folder uh, in my example, it was the uh, under the C users, public documents, ZBrush data, quick save. Even though it's not there anymore, you still need to put the quick save. And make sure you're putting this in quotations. After that, you put a space and then you put in your new location. So for me, it was the D drive backslash quick save. And after you do that, just press enter and, and you'll see that it creates a, uh, a junction which kind of looks like a shortcut uh, folder. And now every time you do quick saves, the, uh, the quick save files will be saved into your uh, new location.